Okay, I'm going to show you how to do this surface that's recessed down on this end, and then it's flush over here. Um, so I'm going to start a sketch. And so the trick is, oh, this is all one right now. We'll, we'll slice, we'll cut this. <clears throat> we'll split it in a minute. Um, but for now, we're going to draw out this. getting this marked out. So I'm going to do the wider to the wider, this outer edge right now. This isn't going to be exact. to state the obvious. Doesn't matter. Okay. Mirror. Split line this. So it goes all the way through because it's not split here, so it's all one surface. Um, it doesn't really matter because this is probably the same on both sides, but you would just split it um, ahead of time using the plane, the front plane. You can split intersection. Um, anyway, so this is flush, so I'm going to use this edge. And then I need to offset this to this depth. I don't know what that is. Um, surface offset surface, um, uh, 0.2, I never work in inches, let's see, sure, looks good. So we're going inside for this, and then we're going to offset surface, okay, clear, this guy to zero, perfect. All right, and then we're going to hide, hide this guy. And then what we're going to do is front plane sketch. I'm just getting this so I can trim it. Keep. There we go. And then we're going to trim this guy too. And we're going to do it wherever we want it to start tapering down to get that flush. Probably closer and we can adjust this. Surface, trim, keep. And then we're going to do boundary surface, this edge to this edge. This edge is going to be tangent and this is right this ends right where we want it to get tangent. So you want to go right there, whatever that edge. You want to like draw it nicely, I guess you could say. Tangent. So check from the side. You can pull this back a little bit, but probably not too much. I don't know. Let's, we'll see what it looks like. weird. So that's when, um, sketch, pull back. All right, that's better. I think that's good. All right, so now, <clears throat> turn this back on. So now I've got this bottom surface here. We don't need this guy anymore. Delete. Okay, 
So now what we do need is to trim this guy out here. And this isn't rounded. I would actually round this. It'll make it easier. Let's just do it now. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm sure it's more than enough. Okay. So we've got that. Now I've got the round that we want. Yes, yes. Oh, it blew everything up, of course. This is fixed. All right, we need to delete this surface. So we're going to delete face. There we go. Now we can see this down here. So this is that surface. Um, we actually need to trim this out because we don't want to go to points. So I'll show you. So now we're going to draw in, it's hard to see it here, but the inside of this chamfer. You need to go to bed, sweetie. You never told us to turn off the light. Oh, sorry. It's bedtime. Okay. So I'm just looking at this edge. And so like, let's say it's a, this isn't what's happening, but it happens a lot. Let's say it's a chamfer that, I wanna make sure that this is inside of that, that kind of tapers a bit. So we'll, we'll, we'll go dramatic on this guy, just to show how you could do it. Center line. I want to make sure it's centered because it's kind of weird the way I did this. So we're going to keep this and this. And so we want a square. SolidWorks like squares. Oh, I did round that out. I keep forgetting to do that. Um, all right. Yes, I know. Yes, yes. Alright, let's do 0.15. We'll go smaller. We want to have this here because it'll make up, oh, because we're going to do a boundary surface and it's going to make that go more smoothly. Okay, surface, trim surface. Keep, keep. Lovely. Okay, so that's our in. This is this bottom surface now. Now, um, all right. So this, oops, this is all set here. I'm gonna knit this because it'll make the next part go more smoothly. Because now I've got this going tangent, and I can add a few 3D sketches in here at key points, like here. It's gonna boundary surface will have a hard time when this surface is broken, so I try not to have broken surfaces. It's gonna have a hard time at these points where the lines do this. It's just gonna help it along. So I'm actually just gonna do this side and then I'll do this side and the bottom and then I could try and, I'll try and do all of it at once. But 
if it doesn't work, then you just break it up. Like if the if it gets funky making this transition. See? All right. Should be good. Surface, boundary surface. Here we go. edges now. Why do you have to have to walk so Because, um, because I was with you this afternoon and went and got cookies. Um, a handle. What is it a handle for? Um, a saw. What kind of saw is it? <laughs> um, a hacksaw. What's a hacksaw? It's a saw um, that you use to cut things. Yeah, but you use all saws to cut things. What is a hacksaw? Right, that looks good. Do you use it for hacks? How <laughs> long am I going to write the words on it? Um, this? Yeah. Not right now. Okay, so this is that. Um, so see how it fades out? So it's like a tangent. It fades. What's tangent? Tangent means it's like smooth transition. Like this is it not is tangent. Really smooth. It is really smooth. Why is that enter your search term staying there forever? Okay. Um, and then watch me blow this up. Um, I can blow it up. No. <laughs> I can change this if it's terrible. Hypothetically. Yes, I can. Oh, we have to rebuild. Oh, did it work? Yes. Oh yeah, it did work. Wait, I don't see the difference. It's it's there. It's just because this is still tapering the same amount. It's hard to see. Let's see if we can push it. We'll do point three. Okay, ready? See? You can see that, right? I think. But this stays tapering because of how we built it. You start to get a crease. See that crease? That's going to show up. And see, then it translates up here. Well, let's get something from Sneaky Sasquatch because all the, because Sneaky Sasquatch can be a little, really glitchy sometimes. Oh, really? Yeah, sometimes you're holding something, but it looks like it's like partly in your hand going through your hand. Huh. Okay, so I'm going to save sometimes, this. Sometimes, and usually, when you like, um, so when you went skiing or golfing, you do this, you do this, and for skiing, you just stick it through your head.